Hello, folks, for I am the one, the only. I am Hobo Tom. Wow. That was like near perfect volume. I can't, it's just right. And I do apologize for getting this video a little bit late. Um, it's been a busy weekend at work. Oh, I can say I did that. Scratch that off. Got some extra scratch this week, which is always good. It's an extra hour and a half. My boss said I could show up early. We all left late. Today sucked. Um, let's see here. I do have some thank yous to give us. So I'll do that next. Let's see here. Adar Lohenheim. Thank you, sir. I think you helped, you helped comment on one post I made on the Jim Cornette show. You, sir, you always win twice because you get that six count. And then Scott Gray. Yep. I think, again, another comment on the Jim Cornette show. I think Jim Cornette was going over some wrestling from the 50s. And I think my comment was, you know what? I'd be somewhat interested to know how wrestling fared during the whole Korean War thing. So, yeah.
So now with that being said, let's talk about some SmackDown. Um, it was a decent show. I missed part of it. I did have to work, so I kind of watched probably about three quarters live. I had to watch a quarter a little bit later. Uh, the summer of Cena continues. Oh, and wait for my bonus at the end. <laughs> uh, summer of Cena con continues. John Cena is a promo. Baron Corbin confronts Cena. Yeah, that is what it was. Uh, then our first match, we have Rey Mysterio taking on Jimmy Uso. And I guess Jimmy Uso now has the red hair. Uh, Jimmy Uso, again, he's a little more heavy-handed than Rey. Again, he's physically bigger than Rey Mysterio. Rey Mysterio is never the tallest individual. So, yeah. Um, again, Rey can still flip and do everything, though. Rey, we're not worthy. We're not worthy. We're not worthy. Uh, again, he's, again, he got sent into the top turnbuckle. That actually takes a lot. Uh, Jimmy Uso, again, the, the, the over the root. Over over the rope Instaguri kick, and always Im impressive. Um, Ray drop, they drop kicked him to the knee, again setting up, kind of for the six one nine. But Jay Uso pulled him out, and he did some. He did the corkscrew plancha. Again, just call it a plancha. Toby going a little with a twist. No, it's a corkscrew plancha. That's all you have to call it. And um, then Ray hit a crucifix pin after this time. Dominic interfered. The faces get their comeuppance. Good fun match. Ray Mysterio wins. I can't complain. Cheeseburger match. Oh, what? That was a sign of one. That's okay. Uh, Bianca Belotti comes out of... Promo, Carmella interrupts. Carmella's 50-year-old Florida MILF. Who cares? Then we have Reginald versus Chad Gable. This was fun because Reginald's still doing the flippy stuff. He can flip all over the place, though. Um, and every time Jed, Chad Gable put him in a suplex, he flipped out of it. Again, the, the German, German superplex. I don't even know how you flip out of that. That was great. Then Otis just had enough. Otis interfered. Reginald wins by disqualification. Meh, a ham sandwich of a match. Oh, wow. There were only the four matches. Then we have the contract signing. Um, Adam Page, no truer words were ever said. Um, and by Adam Pierce, not Adam Page, I'm sorry. Uh, getting things muddled up. Adam Pierce, truer words were never spoken. Yeah, and uh, it went to paraphrase him. Yeah, we know all these kind track signings go. Generally, something bad happens. There's punches thrown, tables broken. Yeah. Uh, Finn Balor comes out. He sits to Stan Rain sits, takes the head of the table. Kind of a nice table, so that table wasn't going to be broken. Um, then Baron Corbin attacks Finn Balor, takes a contract. And then John Cena shows up, beats up Baron Corbin, and Cena signs the contract. I guess we're going to get John Cena versus Roman Reigns for SummerSlam. <sighs> It'll be okay. Then we have six man tag team schmoz. Um, Big E, Cesaro, and Shinsuke Nakamura taking on Apollo Cruz, Dolph Ziggler, and Bobby Roode. I'm curious. Is Shinsuke Nakamura now? Does he just say, Pff, I don't care about the red or blue band, well, red or blue brand. I'm just going to wear my New Japan stuff. You never know. Uh, Big E, again. That was great. Uh, he was there. He, he outsmarted. Um, Ziggler for a little bit. Or actually, uh, uh, Big E was sent to the outside. They're a great spine buster, zigzag combination. 
Dolph and, Ro and Robert Roode are pretty good together. I'll give him that much. Cesaro, again, he goes in. You know, he has the big boot to Ziggler. Uh, gets the swing. Ten times. Then into the sharpshooters. Uh, Shinsuke Nakamura hit a guillotine knee drop. Cruz, again, hits his moves. His standing moonsault. Uh, Roode hits the spine buster. Ziggler, the famouser. Oh, wait a second. Now it's the spot fest. We all know how that goes. Ring the buzzer, ding, ding, ding. Everyone hits their moves. And um, then Boogs goes on, <laughs> Boogs goes on to the car. The guitar uh, provides a distraction. Um, eventually, I think Commander Aziz does get involved too. Someone took the guitar away from him. I think it was Commander Aziz was like upset with that. So, but he looked like he was gonna flash, smash the flying V, which would be a travesty to all the guitars everywhere. Uh, Shinsuke Nakamura eventually hit the Kinshasa on Apollo Cruz and wins the match. It was fun. Cheeseburger match. Uh, then the one's an edge promo, but no, we were swerved because then Seth Rollins jumps in, and Seth looked like he was in. El Idolo or Andrade Cien Almas gear. So that was pretty good. Um, oh, what closed the match? Oh, that, oh, that's right. Then we had Carmella and Z Z and Zelina Vega taking on Bianca Belair and Sasha Banks. Hmm. You know something's gonna happen here. Uh, Bianca Belair had the drop kick and they uh, Bianca Belair and Sasha Banks had some quick tags in the double drop kick. Um, Sasha got used as a weapon. Sasha got lawn darted um, into Carmella and Zelina. That was interesting. Um, and this time Carmella did not have a wardrobe malfunction, unlike the one house show. Never get to see that, I guess. And then from the break, Zelina uh, locks in the Black Widow. And ooh, that's always good. Um, reversed. On like a back, uh, reversed. And then hit a backbreaker. Again, always looks, yeah, back something. I forget what it was. Yeah, by this, the wine was just kicking in. He had no wardrobe malfunction. I'm um, Sasha got the hot tag. Um, she hit the three amigos, the frog splash. Tribute to Eddie Guerrero. Uh, Carmella hit the face buster. Tried for it a second time, but no, didn't work out. Sasha hit the backstabber into the bank statement. Sasha Banks and Bianca Belair win. Cheeseburger match. But that's not the half of it. As the show ended, yes, everyone's all cheery. They all their hands raised, and then whap! Sasha Banks clocked Bel Air. So you know what's gonna happen for SummerSlam: Sasha Banks versus Bianca Belair, and Sasha Banks is going to get that belt, probably. So that was good. So we finally saw the the turn, uh, Bianca again. Got backstabbed, the ground and pound, flawless victory by Sasha Banks. And that's it. That was a SmackDown. Pretty average SmackDown. Can't complain about it. Solid cheeseburger SmackDown. And that was it. <laughs> Not much else to really talk about. I'm kind of a very... Oh, wow. Yeah, this makes me sound cool. Yeah, baby. But yeah, um, very average middle of the show. SmackDown. Oh, the important news. This guy, Ho Bo Tom, tomorrow is going to head up to Daly's Place. I want to see if I can get my tickets live. Um, mainly because I don't feel like paying the ridiculous fees that ticket agencies have. I've never liked doing that. Yeah, and it's also something I can put on the door of wrestling. I, th I don't think I have. 
I don't have an AEW ticket up there. I think the last time I had to do it, I think the last time I saw AEW, I did have to pay, go through Ticketmaster. I was not necessarily happy with that. But this time, I'm going to go up there to see a friend and get my tickets, and I'll be happy. So this video hopefully gets to go up before, well, will go up before my Raw review. I don't know if I'll get it done in the morning or when I leave because I'm kind of getting tired. And yeah, it's like that time for bed. So other than that, I'd like to thank everyone for watching. Please like, share, comment, subscribe. And I'll do my review of 